Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Vault Hunters. Hey, I am still strip mining, but I think I'm I think I'm done for the day, guys. So if you look on, I can't for some reason I can't show the map underground. I don't know if that's a setting where we can uh, see the map underground. Uh, toggle rendering all waypoints. Uh, yeah, I can't. Um, I guess it doesn't have underground mode unless it does and we just I don't know what the key is for it but I'm underground you can kind of see it on my big map up there I mean I've went uh, all the way down there um, I don't know how I just created this waypoint though uh, this waypoint right here delete confirmation okay I don't know how I did that but um, so I went all the way down there and then there is a massive cave system uh, that's over there and um, not a cave system but what they call mine shafts there's a massive mine shaft over there and I got lots and lots of goodies and I even left some for link I sent him a I sent him a description on where oh we went the wrong way I sent him a description in a discord on where to go to get it because I know he's having a hard time uh, finding diamonds and finding um, the uh, the ore that we need and i actually found some ore right there so right here is where i found it um and then there's some more that's down there so uh we have um i think we have 14 i have 17 more diamonds and that's only because i have this diamond pickaxe and i'll show you what's going on back at the base and uh we will go from there but yeah guys thanks for returning on episode number two this is going to be a slow start on this series i feel because it's pretty hard guys i'm not gonna i'm not gonna lie with you it's pretty it's a difficult mod pack uh to get started on because you don't really have much i mean we're basically playing vanilla and i know the older version of uh, vault hunters you actually had to complete like i said the vanilla version first uh, but on this one, you just got to find this ore, which is extremely hard. But just so you guys know, if you go down to Y level, negative 50, that's where it's all at. Uh, I've had uh, two good lucks on that one. Uh, the one was strip mining. The other one actually is inside of the uh, mine shaft on the wall. But the mine shaft, oh, great. Of course it's raining. Every time I freaking record, it rains. Uh, let's go in here to options, sound. We'll turn weather down. So you guys can hear me. All right, there we go. Uh, we need to get up. So let's go over here. But yeah, I did a couple things last night. I uh, I got back on and um, I went, of course, you know, last episode we went and did some kidnapping and we got some uh, three adults and three kids. And then you can see here, I marked one called Big Village. And then over there is a Castle Village. And that Castle Village is freaking fantastic. Oh, God. Uh, I'll go and show it to you on the map, but there's actually a castle there, and it's pretty cool. So I went over there and grabbed uh, two more uh, villagers only because our villagers died. Um, well, I, they didn't actually die. I killed them. <laughs> uh, only because uh, when you put, I guess for whatever reason, when you put villagers in, uh, they have a chance of spawning an iron golem, and the iron golem was standing on this, and he wouldn't move. So I killed it, right? I killed the iron golem. Well, it lowered the adults that were here. It lowered, or it made them mad. So when I went to do a trade with them, their trades were, like, freaking expensive. And I'm like, you know what? We'll just redo it. So I went and got three more adults. Uh, these are the three kids right here. That one, that one, and that one. And these uh, are the original three, and then that's, uh, or actually, they're not the original. It's... Uh, the adults that I went and got. This guy still hasn't changed, so I just have to keep breaking this and replacing it. And then this guy here's got Fortune 2. So if we look on him, I was able to get him to Fortune 2, and then he also has Quick Charge and Serpent Charmer, but we haven't, I haven't done any more on him. Um, I, I think what you have to do is uh, at least get them past Novice, which is the first. I think you have to get them into the next two tiers to keep them here. Um, to get, keep them low chunked. This one is Unbreaking 1, and he also has Lore 2. Uh, and then this guy down here is Efficiency 1. So I've been doing a bunch of trades with him. That's how I got this pick. It's got Efficiency 2. I got two books and combined them. And then he also has Depth Strider, uh, which increases underwater movement speed, which doesn't increase your breathing underwater, though. And then this guy's got Piercing and then Looting 3. So that's a good sword there. So I got to get this guy... Um, I'm just using him to get the emeralds 
and then I can buy food uh, if we need to. And then this guy hasn't switched yet, and then this guy hasn't switched yet. So we just got to keep breaking these. I have these trap doors right here, so if I want to get in, I can go in like this. But they can't because they don't understand what that is. And their head hits this, so they will never leave. So this keeps them nice and safe. And then I put the fence here and then put this lava rock right, or this magma block here, just to keep, sometimes we get uh, creepers that want to come over here, but they end up getting killed. Um, not much else happened. Oh, if you guys didn't know, when you breed pigs, they breed three babies. It's just not like one little baby, it's three. So you gotta watch out for that. Uh, I did move the garden to this side of the house. So over here is our garden now. So this is all the wheat. And then I was doing all of uh, the carrots for that trader. And then I need paper for one of the other traders, but he's dead. So I don't have him anymore. And then I just got these. So that's our food source. I started building my own little thing up there. That is the, um, what is it called? The... Um, it's the block from calcite. It's the block that goes around the geodes. There's two gigantic geodes literally like underneath us here. They're stacked on top of each other. So that's where I got that. And I'll finish that on my own time. And then for Link, I made him a pick just like mine. Uh, I didn't put, I ran out of experience though. So uh, Link, if you're watching, I'm sure he'll have it by the time this video comes out. Uh, there's a book right here. So. There's an extra villager that I grabbed in case one of these other guys decides to get pissed off. So I can just kill him and put another villager in there. Um, and then I got all these books because one of those villagers trades books. So, or uh, bookshelves. So all we need is an enchantment table right there. But we don't have the equipment for that yet. I had to I had to use some of our iron though to get an anvil. So that's a lot of iron. It's like three, what is that, four? I think it's three blocks, four blocks of iron. But we did good. So I am going to uh, cook this up and then we'll put the rest of this stuff in here, including that. And then we'll put um, all our iron in there and then all our copper in there. And then all these blocks here, I'm just going to uh, compress these or not compress them, but make them shiny because I'm using them on uh, the new base. So we're just going to do this and I think that's all. So we'll put these in here for now like that. And then I don't need any of this flesh. We just need a drop off box. It's kind of like a trash box, you know, like a little trash area. I don't know what to do with it. We'll, we'll eventually have some storage systems going on here. I don't need to put that in there. We'll just put it in. This is mine anyways. Uh, diamonds. So we're up to 50 diamonds. We needed, <clears throat> I think that's enough for a whole set of armor. Isn't it 20? Uh, so we got one, two. I'm, I'm thinking in my head. We got one, two, three, four, five for the helmet. Six, seven, eight, nine for the for the shoes. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 for the pants. 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. We have exactly enough for two sets of armor. That's perfect. Uh, maybe I can make some stands and then make uh link a set of armor that'd be perfect i think he actually had oh he got some mana steel that's pretty cool that's pretty cool um so let's put our wood away and our sticks and we'll put our food out here we have food here and then we got food over um on that side as well uh so i wanted to look at something so i was watching um i was watching uh one of the another YouTuber that was playing this mod pack and they actually had all their villagers like in little, in little tiny glass boxes. And um, this is called Easy Villagers. So is there, is there, let's type in easy. Yes, look at this. You can put them in their own little boxes. Huh, I didn't know that. So there's a barterer. <clears throat> can you make these then? A breeder. Um. Uh, yeah, so that's not a thing. <laughs> so you actually have to like do stuff to get this. Okay, so it says treasure chest level uh, found in a treasure chest, but you can make them too by using this. All right, well, that makes sense. Uh, the other thing that I saw was a way to put animals like on almost a, like a botany pot. Um, I'm just going to type in farm. I don't I don't know what it was, though. Um, animal animal pen. 
So it's polished vault stone. I think we have vault stone. If not, I know where there's some at. I just wonder if this is like a thing. Uh, vault cobblestone. Do you just make polish this way? I bet you have to burn it. Let's cook it real quick and see. Oh, let's put it in this one. Let's grab that. Put that in there. And then let's grab some coal. Let's grab all that coal and put that in there. And does that cook that? It does cook that. Um, at the vault. So I just wonder if that's what it is. I wonder if it drops. Like, if you put the animal in there, does it does it produce something? That's what I'm wondering. We'll find out. Crouch right click on an animal to catch for the use in the animal pen. How do you make this? Um, we gotta have a certain type of glass. Does that have to be quartz glass? Framed glass. So we need glass and iron makes four. And then, um, this just uses, this just showing regular glass. So we could just use regular glass and a polished vault stone. Is this making polished vault stone? It is. All right, cool. So we need some sand. Uh, do I have my shovel anymore? I don't have my shovel anymore. Um, I used all our sand here. I might have a couple pieces over here. I mean, we need, we need, uh, seven pieces of sand. Uh, is there any sand? Like, yeah, there's some sand over here. Let's go grab this sand here. So today, guys, I don't really have anything particular planned. I might try to make the vault, um, what you might call it, the vault, uh, altar. But I don't think that we have the equipment to get into the vault. I think it's going to, there's a recipe. Once you make the vault altar, you got to make another, there's a couple of items you got to put on it in order to make the vault key or the vault crystal, I think is what it's called. So I think that's the next step. So we might, we might get to that. Let's go ahead and make some glass though. We'll put this iron in there. Uh, what does it take to make a, a, a stand though? An armor stand. It takes uh, sticks and a smooth stone slab. Does that have to be a smooth stone slab? Looks like it. All right. So we got to cook some cobble. Uh, let's cook some cobble. It's glass. So that's that's that. I think that's enough. Let's go ahead and put uh, the cobble in there and cook that. Let's go ahead and sleep. So yeah, um, I got everything moved around. I think we're good on this little spawn base area. Uh, oh, what I was going to show you is uh, if we zoom out and we come over here, you can see that there's a castle here. This village is gigantic. Every one of these brown things is a, is a roof. And there's tons of villagers in here. You know what? I didn't even see this building. I didn't even see that. I want to go back and see what that is. I did see this. This is a like a... Uh, a greenhouse so it has bees inside of it and then this is the blacksmith's house and then it looks like there might have been another blacksmith over here i came in through this direction went into the castle and then came back out and came down this direction um this biome is gigantic i'm trying to find like a jungle biome um but I couldn't find a jungle biome. So we'll, we'll keep looking, but I'd really like to find a jungle biome so I can get some, I'd like to find what I'm trying to, what I'm trying to find. If you're, if you're wondering why this is like this, this is where, um, when we started the server, this is where it started us out at. And so I moved spawn, uh, over to here. So it just, it just didn't save the, the map. So, um, that's what that is. So that's, that's a, a village over there too, but it's in the snow. And I didn't want to start out in the snow. So let's go like this. Uh, actually, we don't want to do that. Do I have to cook this a tw cook it twice? Is that how you make smooth stone? Just cook it twice? Ugh, it is. Okay. Well, we'll do that twice. Um, so yeah. So if we look at... Um, you know what? We could probably do. How much cobblestone do we have? So we don't have very much cobblestone. It's weird. All right. Let's go grab some cobblestone. Let's just go over here. Uh, I don't have any food. I have bread. I need to make us a bunch of bread. Like a ton of bread. All right, let's go over here. Let's go grab us some just regular cobblestone. And then I'm going to make uh, some more furnaces. Let's see, is there any... Yeah, there's some stone right here. I'll make some more furnaces for us. And uh, I need to go do a coal run too because we don't have... We're running out of coal. When you strip mine, you use so many torches. It's unreal. It's. I mean, it's... It's ridiculous how many torches you go through. So I needed to go do a coal run. There's a bunch of coal like up high. But now that I got the uh, fortune pickaxe, uh, we'll get a little bit more coal than what we were getting. It'd be nice to have a door on the back side. Maybe I'll do that. Uh, so let's make a let's make another furnace, and we'll put this one up here. And then let's grab some more coal. Uh, can we make tiny coal? Is that in this pack? No, we don't have any mods. Uh, so that's that. 
Uh, this is making the smooth stone. I think we're good on everything. I think we're good on everything. All right, so let's make these slabs. So there's a slab, right? And uh, we need our sticks. Uh, here's our sticks, all right? And then let's make two of these, all right? And then I'll put um, I'll put one here, and then I'll put one there, all right? And then we will go ahead and make uh, two sets of armor. So there's two, and we'll give Link a set, and we'll keep a set, all right? I like that. And then um, the only thing that we need now is just a set of good enchant for our armor. But we might be able to get that just through this. We just need to have a way of farming stuff. So here's the shoes. And we'll put that on there. Uh, the other way is to maybe get... What is it? A leather worker? Or blacksmith? I think is... Uh, what are we missing? The pants. Okay. Uh, I forget what trader it is that does the, the armor. I think it's... We'll have to go look. So there's that, and then uh, there's that. All right, cool. So we still have two diamonds left. We'll get more diamonds. I'm not not too worried about that. All right, so we need these jars. Uh, do a jar, all right? And then we need this one, animal jar. Why don't we do it like this, all right, animal jar. All right, an animal jar. All right, so if I click this guy, shift click. All right, he's in that jar, that's cool. All right, and then we need to make the pin, right? So go to at vault, right? At vault, and then pin, animal pin. And then we just need, uh, we need two fences. Uh, I don't have any fences left. I might just go and steal some fences. Uh, I'll just steal these here. We'll replace them later. And let's go back in here, and then we should be able to have this. All right, that's a pin. So do I put this pin on top of a chest? Is that how that works? Um, so if I do this, uh, let's just set this like, let's just set it right here. And then if I put this here, right, and then I go like this. So what does it do? I don't know. <laughs> you guys tell me, does it like, <laughs> does it provide milk or something? Or does it provide like, do I feed it? All right, so I figured it out. Um, we did it all, we did it all wrong. <laughs> we did it all wrong. Um, I don't think, here, let's just do this. Can't kill that one. There we go. So, oh, we got the jar back. Oh, that's fantastic. So what we can do, here, I'll show you guys. We don't need all this. You can capture, as long as you have one jar, uh, all the all the animals you want. So we have in there, it shows there are 13 cows, right? Uh, we have 13 cows. We could do more, but we don't need more. And then you just shift click them onto this thing or you just click on there. All right, so you can see here if I hold shift down above the cow, it says there's 13 cows, right? So if I go over here and I grab some food, uh, we don't have any in there. So we'll go around back and grab some. I think there's some in here. There is. Uh, we can feed these cows now. And it basically feeds all of them. So we should have, if there's 13, they should what? Um, so it's like only six of them will breed. So we should have what? 19 if I, if I feed these guys. So there. So we should have, yeah, 19. And they will be... Uh, fully bred in a minute 19 so we can just keep doing this uh like all the time right so that will be our we don't need any of this anymore which is great which is perfect because we might put it'd be nice to have maybe put the um the vault uh the vault portal right here so what we can do now is do the same thing for the pigs all right, so we're going to do the same thing for the pigs, and we'll put the pigs uh, right there. Now, you don't need a chest, by the way, so that, that was pointless. We didn't need that. Um, now that I know that, I kind of want to put this on something nice. We'll just go get some more of that block. We'll just put them there for right now. Uh, let's do that, and then we'll just set these guys right here. Put that like that. Cool. All right, so now we can do the pigs. So we need to make another jar. So let's go to vault and then the jar. So we just need to make one more of these. Oh, we're missing two more glass. Uh, did I not make enough glass? We didn't have enough. We didn't have enough. Uh, we didn't have enough. Uh, enough sand. <laughs> 
So let's go get some more sand. So I'm going to do this for, so you could do this with every animal, by the way. So every animal that's in the game, even including bees, uh, you can do this for. I wish that we had uh, our shovel, but we don't. So that's probably what I'm going to do is I'm going to put all these alongside the house. I might move the entrance to the cave around to the other side so that we can have all our villagers and all our animals. They're not they're not an automated farm. That's what I found out. So they're not an automated farm. Uh, talking about the animals. Uh, but you can still get uh, the items out of it and I'll show you here in a second. So let's just go ahead and we'll we'll cook eight in there and eight in there. So uh, let's say that you wanted to, we'll wait till they are done breeding. They're done breeding. So if I want just one, let's say I want, uh, so if I if I hit this guy, it's not gonna kill all 19, so you only kill one of them, right? So see, I killed one and we got this and that. So it only kills one, so we only have 18 left, right? So, and because they've already bred, I can breed it again. They're done breeding, so we can breed these guys again. Yes. So now we have 27, and I can breed it again in, an, in a minute and 34 seconds. So I think it's infinite, <laughs> which is freaking cool. Uh, so we have basically, uh, we can have like a thousand cows, and we'll have an infinite supply of not only leather, uh, but we'll have an in infinite supply of food. So we're going to make uh, another jar. So let's go ahead and make another jar. All right. So we got that. And um, let's go ahead and make two jars. And then we just need the pin. So I need another pin. So let's make another one of these things. All right. So we have two more of those. Perfect. And we will go out here. Please open. <laughs> and we'll put, uh, we already have one here. So we'll put a pin here. So let's put a pin there. And then we'll do another one. We'll just put it right there. And we'll put another one here. All right. So let's go ahead and grab all our pigs. So we'll grab all our piggies. All right. And then we'll take these bad guys and we'll put them in here. Click it uh, right there. All right. So pigs count f uh, five. I think they breed like three every time. So if we feed these, uh, that would probably be like probably six more. So it might go up to 11. Went up to seven. All right. So it must be different because that one time we got all that we got all those. All right. So, and then the only other thing we need, or the only other animal then, would be a sheep, which uh, would be great to have, because I don't have a sheep, and they're kind of hard to find. Um, it's not that I, I, I killed them all or anything, they're just not around here, but uh, we might be able to go over here and find a sheep just like hanging out on, on the edge here or something. Um, I'm not seeing any sheep over that way. We might get in our boat and go get some. I don't think there's any sheep up, oh geez, if that was a hole, we'd have been dead. We would have been dead. So I'm going to go grab a sheep real quick. And then um, I think we'll go ahead and make the altar. And I'm not going to place it down yet because I want to talk to Link. But at least we'll have this whole area here freed up. And we'll have all the animals right here. So let's go grab. Why did I just... Do they still make noises? I could have swore I just heard a pig. Um, Let me go grab a sheep. I think there might be some sheep over here. Let's just go over here real quick. Tell you what, I'll go get it and I'll bring you back. All right. I didn't find any sheep, but I did find chickens. All right. So we have chickens in there. We have eight chickens. It says grab a bucket. Eggs are ready. Grab a bucket. Um, Let's check something. <laughs> I, I used to have a bucket of water and I feel like when I died, what book is that? Piercing four. Pretty good book. Um, I feel like when I died, I lost my bucket because I don't have it anymore. But I did have a bucket of water. So let's do this. So how is that going to get us? Oh, my Lord. That's how you get eggs? Fantastic. <laughs> so we got 12 eggs. Can you cook the eggs? Is that a thing? No, can't. All right. So uh, raw living chest. So you really can't do anything with eggs. Uh, but we can make some more jars. So I'm just going to put the eggs out here. But we can't cook the... Um, can kill the chickens as well and the chickens if you remember uh to breed the chickens you just need this so that just made us uh 12 chickens the cows are ready to be bred again so we can breed the cows again and uh so we can go like this so what's cool is did it take all of them so i only bred three okay 
So I wonder if you like hold a whole stack of food. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But yeah, that's that's what we did today, guys. I'm gonna take a screenshot of that. Kind of look down, and we're gonna go. Uh, I guess that's okay. We'll go like this. Good, good screenshot. All right. Well, that's all we're gonna do today, guys. I didn't. That's the back of me, man. That's all we're going to do today, guys. Uh, I didn't know what we're going to get into. I'm going to fix the villagers back there, those two villagers, and see if we can get something good going on. And i got to figure out why I'm putting um, all these little waypoints everywhere. It must be a key binding or some issue, so it must be something I'm pressing. Uh, but yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, smack the like button, hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to go check out Link's videos, too. Uh, his um, link is in the description below, so go watch his videos when they come out. And I'll see you next time.